The sun also creates giant plasma arcs called prominences, looping high into space, large enough to dwarf Earth a thousand times over. Some of this plasma eventually falls back as coronal rain, except unlike Earth's rain, it's millions of degrees hot. And sometimes those loops don't come back at all. Instead, they snap and explode outward as coronal mass ejections, throwing billions of tons of matter across the solar system with the power to disrupt satellites and even our power grids. Moving inward, we reach the chromosphere, where jets of plasma called spicules shoot upward at hundreds of kilometers per second, faster than the speed of sound. These slender spikes of blazing material rise and vanish within minutes, showing the restless energy bottled inside the sun. Finally, we arrive at the photosphere the layer we see with our own eyes. Here we find sunspots, dark, cooler regions where magnetic fields are strongest. Closely linked with solar flares, these spots remind us that calm appearances often hide violent forces beneath the surface. 